Sam has something on uh, on Bobo. Bobo? Uh, Not the pretty Bobo. No, no, no. All right. The even prettier Bobo. <laughs> That's right. On Friday, when you know we weren't on the air, all day he was calling people who work here, mainly me. Yeah. But he was literally on the, and he was, kept calling Liam too. The talent booker asking why he can't be booked the on Owen. The talent Owen. booker? Yes, he he's keeps, <laughs> like, and I'm going Bobo. Now, how would he get the talent booker's number? Well, because once Liam uh, got him an XM subscription or something like that. I don't remember what uh -huh. it was, and Call Bobo him. saved his number. <laughs> very, yeah. very clever. Bobo's smart for a very retard. clever, yeah, for But he, retard. like, he doesn't understand. I go, Bobo, you have to, you know, there's lots of people who want to come on the show. We're doing uh -huh. a show. You can't just say, well, I want to come on and start yelling and crying and expect to come on. You have to actually have something. But he doesn't. I mean, that's not his way of thinking. Well, doesn't he have characters? Yeah. I've <laughs> seen every time he's been sitting out there in the hallway, never coming in the show. Yeah. But sitting out in the hallway. I walk out and Bobo has just a multitude of new characters. Well, we've been brainstorming characters with him on the phone so he can come in with some new stuff. What is the, what is the, like, give me one character. Uh, one character was Daniel Curlin, the gay abused car salesman. The gay, <laughs> Daniel Curlin, the gay abused <laughs> car salesman. But you salesman. see, it's a different Daniel Curlin. It's just a coincidence that they have the same yeah. name. That they have the same yes. name, right. Yeah. All right, we'll, we'll interview him as characters. <laughs> yeah, um, just characters. But we need three, tell There was yeah. another one. Fuck uh, it, he just found a way it, back on the show. I written down. I'll, let me there go. was one guy, who, who was a guy who was afraid of the post office? <laughs> Oh, well, because of the post he created this character who was afraid of the post office, and we went through some improv exercises. Uh -huh. And the How'd guy, that work out? well, the guy was afraid of the post office because he thought that somebody was sending him mail bombs. <laughs> and one day, as Bobo That's and the brilliant. character, he got a package, and he opened it, and it turned out to be a mail bomb. And it was a mail bomb. So that character How? died. So he won't be oh, on the air. He won't be on. That's ironic. But, by the way, what was his name? I, that's what Danny's looking up. We can't even remember. But his mother is now a character. So Bobo now portrays his, that character's mother. <laughs> wow. Wow. Nice. Wow, he's a weirdo. Is yeah. he was jabbing a fucking coat hanger into his crotch? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh fuck! He has to come on and do this. Well, um, I, as characters, yes, I would. Uh, I would accept that. that. Mr. Amos uses characters. Hey, uh, a lot of people uh, wondering where Voss is because Voss is an FBI profiler. Something oh yeah. We, something we learned while you're on vacation, and yes, um, he is. Voss, when he's bored on the road, will tell people he's an FBI uh, profiler. When he's playing golf. <laughs> he's such an unfamous comedian, he can get away with that. So, <laughs> no so when they ask him on the golf course, what do you do for a living, sometimes he'll say, I'm an FBI profiler. I'm an FBI profiler. And then we called him out on it, and it was horrendous. He stinks at profiling. <laughs> oh, horrendous. so he couldn't... Even the simplest of things he couldn't profile. Well, picture Voss trying to explain... Uh, yeah. You know, wow, well, you know it's a male... Great point. He well, said, that would be a uh, white male, age uh, 35. He what? says uh, when they're on a case, they have lookouts. <laughs> lookouts? He told some guy in a golf course, yeah, when we're hot on a case, we have lookouts. <laughs> How does he leave without a fucking seven iron wrapped around his neck? Know. They feel sorry for him, I think. They yeah. know he's lying. They humor him. Oh, God. Oh, imagine that. They're probably just like, oh, this... Poor guy. So this guy last kind of like standing a few years ago. Now he's uh, pretending to be a profiler. A <laughs> serial killer guy is his expertise, too. Well, he's into the serial killers. Is he uh, profiling the one in uh, Long Island? Oh, it's terrific. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I bet he's right on the money on that one. He's convinced they're a on the East Coast. A black female. <laughs> 62 years old. <laughs> what a... So P is you almost <laughs> adults didn't I almost did, right. but I saved that word. You're back. You didn't. You don't have the list. Yeah, I, don't I know. just I just remembered what the character. Oh, it's Mullet Man. Oh, it was Mullet, Mullet Man. Man. Mullet, Mullet Man. Man. Mullet Man was the guy who was afraid of the post office who died. So now Bobo's other character is Mullet Man's mom. Let me say hi to. Uh... Wow, this is Holly Bobo. Holly Bobo. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait a minute. Now something happened to your son? Yeah, they put a mail bomb. A mail bomb? Yeah, it's right. Took advantage of his, his son, he got a package he was waiting for. 
Now, wasn't he afraid of a mail bomb for so many years? Uh, he kept talking to him, please, take the package, take the package. <laughs> and, and then what happened? He took the package. <laughs> <laughs> And, and and it it blew up. Hello, is he getting in trouble for doing characters? <laughs> He's like I, I heard. Uh, I'm, 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 I'm doing a character, doing character on for the show. show. Oh my god, look at Anson Williams. Uh, so, hello. <laughs> <laughs> mullet man's mom's wait, 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 wait. mom. Mullet man's great grandma. That's mullet man's <laughs> grand. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> what happened there? <laughs> well, I can't hear you. You got to speak up. Yell. She was asleep. We didn't want to wake her up. Well, we can't hear you. So if 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 uh, we can't hear you, got to speak louder. You we cannot hear you. Speak up. Oh, okay. You didn't want to wake her up. Uh, where is Mullet Man now? Six feet under. <laughs> oh, he did die in that explosion? Yes. We can't hear you. You got to be louder. He did. Yeah? What did yes. the explosion sound like? <laughs> what does who sound like? What did the explosion sound like? I can't hear you, ma'am. You're on the radio right now. You have yeah, to be louder. Come on. <laughs> Just sounds like wind. Yes, wind. Now, uh, uh, Mullet Man's mom. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Um, Hello? I'm sure you were very, very distraught when the police came to the house and told you that uh, he was dead, right? Oh, he was. What did that sound like? <laughs> Please recreate entirely and at full volume what it sounded like when you were informed of your son Mullet Man's death. Go. Uh, yes, it is the NYPD. Uh, we got terrible news. Who is it? Uh, your son just died in an explosion. Oh, no. Oh, no. Explosion. What happened? I, I only told him to take in the package and he was excited about getting. I finally told him that he that he needs met jacket he always wanted. Met jacket. <laughs> I did. Yep. He took advantage of his exciting the uh, package. <laughs> idiot. Oh, oh, idiot. Well, you gotta be louder and you're upset. You, you gotta cry and scream like, "Oh my baby!" Oh. Oh, be that idiot. Like those idiots in a terrorist country. I'll beat them up like a like a MMA guy. What? I'll beat them up like an MMA guy. <laughs> <laughs> like an MMA. Guy. I I I don't think I like this character. I don't think I'm digging this character. It's too quiet. It's too quiet. I can't I hear can't it. I can't hear it either. People complain. People are on the radio, and they want to hear a loud person. How about this? Yeah. How about, you know how all the uh, car salesmen have those commercials where they're very, like, sort of boisterous yeah, about the cars yeah. they have in the lot for sale? What if... $500! Exactly. Is it yeah, yeah, yeah. What if Daniel Curlin, the gay-abused car salesman... Ah. Uh, was doing did a commercial right here. That would be good. Uh, Daniel Curlin, the gay car salesman. Abused, the gay, gay <laughs> abused car salesman. Sell us a car. Make like it's a commercial. Oh wait, wait, wait! I just remember uh, something. Yeah, yeah. Because the angle with the car salesman <laughs> was that there, it was he was trying to always sell you a real piece of shit car, ah. but pretending like it was the best deal oh, ever. Oh, now that's and, the angle. And if you were a guy, he would flirt a little bit. Oh, oh yeah. What an angle he's got. Okay, now we got to get this fabulous car. <laughs> it's got massive stereos. Keep keep going, keep going. <laughs> how many how many stereos? A nice purple paint job, nice glittery purple. Fabulous. I can't hear you. Tell us when to make it like a. You ever see a car commercial, you dummy? Do the whole thing. It's got to be like a minute long. Go. This car is fabulous. It's got 
right? It's only got 5,000 miles on it. And it's fabulous. You gotta take out these blurry wheels. It's right there <laughs> on the other corner of Grand and 59th. <laughs> Bo, don't don't actually tell people where you live. <laughs> it's a made-up address. It's a made-up address. It's a made-up address. It's a made-up address. Maintain, it's a made up maintain the character. Maintain yes, the character. character. Come on, what are you doing? It's on the other corner, up on the other corner, Grand and 59th. You gotta check it out. It's fabulous. You got, you got a nice glittery car. You gotta check out this nice gold and lavender. Ugh. So great. And the wheels. They shine nice. Fabulous. Hey, Daniel Curlin, what if a cute guy comes in to buy a car? Ooh, I gotta spank that. You gotta spank that. Hey, anyway, you spank that, and I'll hand you the keys now and spank that. It's only 500 bucks for you. You know what you should do? Because people sleep on car deals. You sh you have to start the commercial by yelling "Wake up," because that's what people have to do to get yeah, these new yeah. car deals. Yell, "Wake up, wake up, wake up!" Okay, just yell. Come on, wake up there, you bitch! Come on, come out here! It's only five hundred bucks for this thing, for this car. <laughs> wake up, bitch! Come on, I'm gonna slap you. I'll get you the keys right now. Oh, I need the keys right now. Is it the gay black? Uh, no, abuse. Is it trying to, just oh, abused. Just abused. What what kind of abuse did you suffer? Uh, I got raped by by my brother. <laughs> I got raped by my brother. He said, and his name is Daniel Curlin, <laughs> and, but he's it's not him. It's a different Daniel. It's a Curlin. different Daniel Curlin. <laughs> God, this motherfucker. There was also, there was one other character. One other character. All right, let's go. One more I, character. I can't remember the guy's name, but I do remember that he sold fruit outside of Mets games. Oh, that's oh. Right. What's, what's, what? <laughs> hey, are you the guy that sells fruit outside the Mets games? What's your name? I am Misa Poppy. Yeah, that's right. I sell, I sell fruit in front of City Field. What's your name? Uh, my name is, uh, my name is, uh, I'm trying to remember. My name is, uh, <laughs> Pedro. That wasn't it. That wasn't it. I don't remember where it was, but it wasn't Pedro. I, 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 forget, the, I forget the name. <laughs> you forgot your own name? I don't know. I'm bad. too much fun in the crunch the border. What? Are you, why, you're Mexican? Yeah, that's right. I can't run running across the border. <laughs> like I freaking just started throwing uh, food at the... Dylan. <laughs> Poop <laughs> Dylan. <laughs> I threw fruit at everybody. Yeah. Like, and I also got fruit thrown at me for one selling vavuzelas. Ah. Oh, that's right. He also sold vavuzelas. Oh, oh fruit right, Fruit and right. vavuzelas. Okay. Well, that sounds uh, great. Um, why don't you tell us about the, uh, your fruit and, and how much it is? And Oh, oh it's fresh. We, I, I, I grew up with my own little special liquid. What? Yeah, I grew up with my own liquid. Your own liquid? Yeah. Is right. it called pre-cum that seems to drip out of your dick every time you fucking <laughs> see a girl? No, it's a yellow liquid. Drinking a lot of water. I don't okay. know. Okay. I, okay. This, okay. There I'm not is, feeling these characters. There's one that's either. more topical. That he well, he said that he was tired of going on the bullshit after show. Right. He wants to come on the main show. The main show, the right. The bullshit show is not for him. No. Uh but while he was on, he said that he was working on a more topical character. Oh. Called Bobo Charlie Sheen. <laughs> Bobo Charlie Sheen? <laughs> yes. That's Hello. Hello. What you doing here? That's right. You're talking to the Gnarls Narlington himself. Winning! Duh! You can't stop me, I'm an F-18, bro! Ooh. Gotta do more! Yeah, this I, is real topical. I can tell you these damn, damn warriors after me, damn haters, all oh, these damn trolls, they don't know, I'm full of tiger blood. And uh, there's only one per other person who can handle Charlie Sheen's drug besides me. That's me. And I can also handle the drug called Daniel. Daniel. <laughs> a drug called Daniel? Yeah, and I also handled a drug called Anthony Cumia. Yeah, that's a lot of drugs. <laughs> Don't bring oh, my yeah, name into your some... stupid fucking skits. What other drugs do you handle? Uh, I also, I also, I also handled any drug named after a guy that died. 
fuck up you. What? Oh, no, I'm gonna be you, bro. <laughs> I could just handle it. I could just throw up with my mind. I could just get those tickets right now with my mind. Tickets? Where's your mother? Uh, she, she's a, she's a, she's asleep. <laughs> I cannot hear you. You, you. We have to hang up on you. You're not being loud enough. Bye, Bobo. He's asleep. Bobo, do you I'm know? Asleep. Bobo, do you have a, a do you have two pots in the house, like a pot and a pan? Uh, I do, I do, but my mother is not. The, my mother. But what about a character? We don't been... care about your your mom. This is you. We need this for the radio, Bobo. Yeah. Do we you understand, Bobo, the one man band. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Our character we need, and this is to get back on the show, is Bobo the One Man Band. Now, what you need, go to the kitchen, okay, Bobo? Bobo? All right. Go to the kitchen, get get two pots, okay? All right. All right you got two pots? Yeah. Now, lay the, lay, the, lay the phone down a little so we can still hear you. All right, I got a speaker. Okay. <laughs> now take the pots and it, Bobo the One Man Band. Smash the pots together real loud. Yeah, like you're like that, that like symbols. Yeah, yeah. Smash them together. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. Go, 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 go. We need a song, Bobo. Bobo the One Man Band. Let's go. Sing a song while you do it. <laughs> Sing a song. Like to stop Mr. because he's an F-18. <laughs> My sister just grabbed the damn thing. My good sister was on the couch. Bobo, sing "Meet the Mets." <laughs> yeah, sing "Meet the Mets" with the pots and pans. Loud oh, though, so we can hear you. Yeah. We'll get the get get another pot. Get another pots and pans. You want to be on, on the show? Come on, we're busy. Come on, you got to get back on the show. Sing "Meet the Mets" with the pots and but pans. Loud, so the listeners can hear you. Yeah, do it. Uh, all right, you, here you go. <laughs> I'm, in my, I'm, in my, I'm in my I'm in my room. I'm in my room. So, so this, this this won't affect my sister. We need pots and pans, though. Pots and pans. <laughs> Meet the Mets. All right, hold it. Hold on, I'm trying to get something. Get something. Let's see. Uh, this is for sleeping on the couch. Meet the mess. Greet the That's not a pot. That stinks. That's not pots and pans. We're pan. gonna hang up. That's not a pot and a pan. <laughs> I guess you don't want to be on the show. I did, but I can't. I can't bang it loud. I don't have anything to bang it on. Then you Where's need to bang the... it on the wall. You need two <laughs> pots and pans. And I try to find something to get to get a hold of it, because you grab the other one. Well, grab it back from her. Wait, hold, hold on. Get it back from her. She's your younger sister. Yeah, she, you come can on. Take her. <laughs> Bobo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm back. I'm back. You got the pot and pan. <laughs> Yeah, 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 I'm back. Now smash them together hard and sing Meet the Mets. We can hear you. All right. Meet the Mets. Meet the Mets. Step right up and meet the Mets. You have the cover you like. Because the Mets are really stuck. Yeah, all up right over the wall. That was that was good. good. I'll give you that. But you need to do it like a parade, okay? <laughs> so 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 march through the house, march through the house, and do the same thing you just did. Uh, uh, all right. They, they won't get sure. mad. Just tell them it's for the show. They'll it's understand. It's for the show. But you got to march like a marching band through the house, loud, and keep the phone somewhere like uh, close to you. Keep it in the middle of the kitchen, all right? Shannon, this is for the show, all right? <laughs> all right, go ahead. I, I won't be harmed, all right? 
I, I'm just trying to make sure Shannon gets Just do it. Wow. Just do it. Go, go, go. We don't have time. <laughs> Come on, Bobo. Let's go. How'd that work out? It worked out good. Yeah? How's your sister holding up? Everyone awake now? Yeah, oh, believe me. <laughs> you are. <laughs> you do not want to know the look on my sister's face and my mother's face. <laughs> I'm sure it's no worse than the fucking look in the delivery room. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go ahead. You just keep talking. <laughs> I know my mother looks like this Shannon was born. Uh, yeah, we... We, yeah, we, is that, <laughs> Jimmy had a much better good one. Is hey. that your hot sister? <laughs> hey, B Bobo, could you do the big finish and smash a glass on the on the floor? <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, you just got my sister. You believe me? You got you won't know how my sister's looking right now. I'm all freaking tired, and I finally got to freaking freaking wake me up. Come, come on for the show, y'all. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shut up, bitch. <laughs> 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 oh, that's Bobo's. Uh... Wow, she's cute. <laughs> oh, she, oh, oh, you oh maybe know, not. She's turning six, she's turning sixteen in September. Oh, she's... All right. Well, that's wonderful. Oh, this is, this is yeah, 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 yeah. I, went, I gave you to ask her on a trip to North, to North Carolina. All right. All right. <laughs> a trip to North Carolina. It's, it's not bad to hear the song. I felt it's a little too late, though. Um, if you can call yeah. back tomorrow, it's six twelve. Yeah, yeah. Call back tomorrow. I like this character, Bobo, the one man band. Yeah, we like that. All right, all right. I'll call back tomorrow. And, and Very get, early. Yeah. And get other instruments for for your one man band. Yes. Because now this this bit is hot. We're gonna go with it, Bobo. Uh, all right. We got two pots and pans and a kazoo. And uh, uh, what song can we go with? <laughs> well, the Meet the Mets thing is just terrific. Yeah. You yeah. being a Mets fan and all that. Tomorrow the kazoo has to be involved. Oh yeah. All right, let's go with... And a pot of boiling uh, water. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Let's go with the song New York, New York tomorrow. All right, New fair York, enough. New York, well, you, got, you got the kazoo just to try it out? Yeah, I got the kazoo. I can, I can tell you the first part of it. Right. Okay. It needs pans. It needs pots and pans. Yeah, the pots and pans. Right, really. Bubba, the percussion work, section makes yeah. it. You work on that for tomorrow, okay? Yeah. <laughs> all right, all right, believe me, I'll be working on it tomorrow. All right, all right it's going to be very early, though, tomorrow, okay? Don't tell anyone that you're doing this. Yeah, yeah. Uh, all right, I got to have some words with my mother, all right, to calm her down right now. Is she mad? Well, why don't you talk well, to her right now? Yeah, why don't we Let's talk hear. to her? You, you, you really, you really want to talk to her? Well, yeah, let's yeah, hear you, yeah. you. Let's hear you smooth things over with her. Go yeah. ahead. All right, and, and mom. All right, they they want to talk to you briefly. All right, just want to talk to you briefly. What a nice wake up call. <laughs> uh, hi. Uh, we don't Ms. know what your Bubba's son was mom. up to. That was weird. Was he being loud? No, just a little. Like the neighbors upstairs and the dog started barking. I heard the dog barking. <laughs> We're asking him to keep it down. And now we can get evicted. Well, he he had a character that he wanted to uh, show us for for the program, and um, I, it. What character was that? Being annoying. No, Bobo the One Man Band. Yeah, Bobo the One Man Band. Bobo the One Man Band is uh, the uh, Bobo, one man band. the character. I like it though. It's a good character. It is a good character. Oh, 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 Daniel, they love it so much. You can now go to their house and wake them up. And you know how uh, he, how he loves being on the show, and I think he's found a new inn. Bobo, the yeah, one-man yeah, band. Yeah, yeah, we know he loves the show, but God damn it, people need to sleep. 
Yeah, I was trying to tell him that, but he just insisted on playing his yeah, instruments. He wanted to keep oh, playing he it. He wanted to blame it all on him. No, no, not blame it on him. It's just it makes him happy. So we're like, yeah, go ahead, do it. It's fun. Oh, sure, okay. <laughs> are you being sarcastic? I think she, I think she is. Are you? Oh, I love you guys, but you, God, you guys are such pain in the asses. <laughs> 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 that should be on a poster. Uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, I might as well make shirts with you guys for my pain in the asses, and I'll have all your pictures on. All right. I'll take okay. care of you. All right. Well, I'm only kidding. You know, you guys are great, but please, oh. come on. <laughs> Let me put the pain in the ass back on the phone. All right. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, uh, yeah, Bobo. Great job, uh, by the way. Bobo, could you tell your mom to get in the kitchen and make you some fucking food? Yeah, I'm getting the kitchen and make me some fucking food. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be an interesting day at the curling house. Exactly. She's in the mirror just booing her vagina. <laughs> <laughs> wow. How you doing, Bobo? I'm doing good. Yeah, okay. Is she cooking for you now? As she is. She's getting the, the pancake mix. Oh, really? Oh, you're going to have some pancakes. Yeah, some pancakes and some sausages. Want you, some want... <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Wait, some pancakes and what? It's sausages. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Does it linger longer? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, linger longer. Can you tell your mom I don't want any fucking pancakes? Hey, your mom, I don't want any fucking pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, yo, mom. I want a fucking <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, God damn. This guy's hysterical. I got one for you. Yeah. Bobo, will you do this one? And, and I swear you'll be back on the show. All right. Go, mom, I need to know. Did you fucking drink when you were pregnant with me? Oh, boy. M mom, I need to know. Did you fucking drink when you were pregnant with me? Oh, no. I know. I can't even do it. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! What's she, what's she saying, Bobo? <laughs> no, she, 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 I forgot. She said no. I didn't. I think I did coke. Holy <laughs> 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 shit! Oh, fuck up. Uh, all right, Bobo. That's, hey, I uh, got one. Oh yeah. Uh oh. You, you should say with the potholders and the drugs in them. <laughs> Where's the, where's the potholders in the gym? Get up and get up. <laughs> you are. Um, that's, that's good. You're great, uh, Bobo. Thank you. Uh, I don't know. I think I think you're in. We'll check it back. Uh, we'll check back with you tomorrow um, for Bobo uh, Curlin. Uh, Bobo, Bobo, the one band. Band. Bobo, Bobo the one Daniel band. Curlin, the one man band. Uh, it's yeah. gonna be great. Keep it simple. Yeah. All right, I'm listen gonna listen to the song right now to try to get to get the song. Yeah, right. yeah, get the song down. Yeah, but don't tell anyone you're doing this tomorrow. All right, don't <laughs> worry, I won't be telling you. You'll just you'll just hear it. <laughs> I hope you're kidding. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Hi, uh, uh, yeah. right, Bobo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> of course. Oh, good all right, you have a good day. All right, I gotta go eat. Yeah, <laughs> Bobo gotta eat. <laughs> there he goes. All right. Holy shit. That's hilarious. He's getting yelled at. Pots and pans are taken away from him. See, he had characters. He, he finally yeah, has like, a character. Like I kind of like Mr. Imus, he's got characters. Yeah. That hour of the morning, bashing pots and pans <laughs> and singing uh, Meet the Mets. <laughs> That's a fantastic right. character right there. It was a slow build, but there was an ending yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, you know, you kind of work Sometimes on this. Sometimes you got to kind of... <laughs> Feel your way around. Oh, and that, that's what makes me wonder how people cannot like Bobo. Like he just, no. he just 
bang pots and pans around. I was sick of the pet song. And, told, he, and he's a grown person. He's not like he's 17, 18. He's like 28 years old. They just told his mom, I don't want no fucking pants. I'm just thinking of his family. It's he's like, a there's a retard banging pots and pans. Like, I'm trying to sleep, and this retard is banging pots and pans. <laughs> but, because Bobo, he's like, he's functional, but he's not. Like, he, he, he gets to go outside by himself and ride the train and shit, yeah. but he probably shouldn't. Yeah, yeah, he's, you know, like, he's kind of out there. I, I've seen people that are just as Bobo, and they, they need 24-hour care. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah.